Um, so what else about um, sort of obviously about Multikai? It's a bit different from some of your other films like Secret Window and um, Premium Rush. What, what was it about the project that drew you to it? Uh, I just I saw this character, <clears throat> and more specifically, I saw Johnny playing it. Uh, mm. because he called up and said, I'd like to play this character, what do you think? Mm. So not a great in intellectual leap on my part. But um, I, I just, it, it seemed like another indelible Johnny Depp character that mm. I wanted to hang around. Mm. Well, there's something, obviously you've worked with Johnny Depp before, you know, on Secret Window, which is a bit more serious role. What was yeah. it like this time around where it's a bit more of a comedic role for him, working with him? You know, we had a lot of laughs on Secret Window because uh, he's funny and, mm. and, and I try to be funny. Um, but obviously they didn't have a place in the movie. It was a very darkish uh, thriller. So the chance to come in and, and just have as our job description the task of cracking each other up all day seemed to me like a dream. Um, and it was. It, it, it presents a real lightness on the set. You know, when you're, you're trying to be funny, you're trying to be amusing. Mo making movies is hard. Things go wrong. People get sick. Sometimes we argue. But the... That you have to hide all that and, and try to keep this atmosphere of, of, of lightness so that the comedy can come out. And uh, I was attracted to that. Well, it's something you are a great cast in film, and because of the nature of the story, was it hard to keep things together at that time? Uh, was it hard to keep things together? Yeah, just, uh, you know, it was everybody sort of cracking up at times. Oh, there was a good deal of that. I was probably the worst offender. Yeah. Um, when I find something funny, I laugh out loud. Mm. It's very hard for me to stop. Mm. Um, but that's terrible when you're recording sound and you're not <laughs> supposed to. You're supposed to be pretending you're not there. Uh, so I'd have to move my my chair down the hall. I I'd, I'd, sometimes the actors would ask me to just go in another room, <laughs> you know. But uh, but it's okay. And even if you ruin a take with laughter, it's a positive thing because you're saying, hey, I think what you're doing is really funny. That's good. Um, like I said, great cast. Did you get everyone you really wanted when you pictured these characters? Did you picture like Gwyneth Paltrow and Ian McGregor? I did. You know. Everybody says it, oh, it was my first choice. But it's absolutely true. Uh, every character in this movie, the actor we got was our first choice. And that just never happens, or at least it never happens to me. It's quite rare. Possibly Spielberg, but yes. not to me. Um, one of the things I liked about the film is um, when you're in like LA and London, you don't show off all the tourist parts of, of the cities. Was this by design to show off maybe some of the other parts? Yeah, we wanted to see the neighborhoods that made sense for the movie. Mm. and. We also, one of the things that I'm proud of stylistically in the movie is our, our we called them our locator shots, mm. when they would go from one city to another, mm. um, then you'd get to see, you know, Parliament in the Eye mm. and, you know, um, the, the, the Kremlin in Moscow, mm. but, um, but we did it in an animated way mm. that was uh, s a sort of hyper-realistic mm. with a CG effect, and, and I, thought that was a, I thought that was a clever way to orient people. Well, one great thing about the film is, you know, there's a great sense of Britishness to it. Um, was it really important for you to keep it, make sure it didn't go too over the top and rub just the right sense? Yeah, of I mean, we, you know, it's not, it's not realistic. No. <laughs> Our film, no. <laughs> um, obviously, we were having a bit of fun, mm -hmm. uh, but part of the fun of being an outsider and coming here is that, um, you know, everything seemed fresh to me. Everything seemed new, even places where some crew members would say, oh, we've shot here three times. I'd say, I've never seen it. I think it's great. Mm. Um, so it's fun to bring an outsider's eye to somebody else's city and yeah. culture. And very funny, very quickly, he's from Stash, real or fake? Oh, fake. <laughs> it is definitely uh, fake. Very fake, and there were about 20 of them. I uh, think you can <laughs> probably buy them on eBay if, uh, you, if you want. Uh, great. <laughs> David, it's been a pleasure meeting you today. Thanks, Thanks likewise. Very much.